I'm Joanne and this is Rocket Boom. I'm Joanne and this is Rocket Boom. I've come over to Chelsea to the art gallery Bitforms. And if you watch Rocket Boom on a regular basis, you're probably familiar with Bitforms. We're going to go upstairs and talk to Steve about Raphael Luzzano Hammer. Sure, the artist's name is Raphael Lozano Hemmer. He's really incredibly well known for very large scale interactive public installations. Uh, this chair installation is called Wave Function. And again, it's another one of these interactive works, but on a, in, in, his, in this case, actually a much smaller scale. And as you approach the piece, your body acts as uh, a droplet or, or a wave that uh, initiates movement within the work. So it's basically dealing with the mathematics of fluid dynamics. So as other people approach the piece, there's kind of a, a conflict between the waves that happen within the work. You typically would see a chair in its, in its, in its place and you don't expect you know, this, this powerful movement to occur or this interactivity to occur. So all of these things kind of um, get empowered by the individual that approaches the piece. This piece is called Less Than Three, and this is more of a voice-activated work. It also deals with light. I think really the beauty is, is the simplicity and this idea of, you know, the voice traveling through light. What happens in this work is it's actually converting voice to light. So all of these uh, little numbers on here are nodes within the network. So when someone does activate the piece. Hello, how are you today? A path is created based on the network that was built into the piece. And you could see a very light colored wire, and then you could see the movement of each of these segments are based on the syncopation or the length of my voice. And eventually it will get to the other end and release my voice on the other side. As I said earlier, each voice takes a random path. So most likely you will never see the same path twice. So Steve, if we want to read more about these artists, or some of the other artists that have exhibited their work or who are going to be coming to Bitforms, where can we go? Sure, you can go to my website, is always the best place. It's uh, bitforms.com. And another site you can go to if you're specifically interested in Raphael's work is lozano-hemmer.com.